extraordinary people like our next guest, Shamika Campbell, who bend over backwards to embrace what makes them unique. In Shamika's case, she does it literally. The 31-year-old is a world-renowned limbo artist who holds three Guinness World Records, including the record for the lowest limbo ever at 8.5 inches. In her case, okay, so I'm gonna hold this ruler up so you can visualize just what that is. 8.5 inches, I need glasses, but right about here is where, that's how low we're talking. Shamika has been lighting up Las Vegas at the Cosmopolitan Hotel, by the way, beautiful hotel, even performing for Usher. And now she's bringing her unmatched talents to the Tan Fam. I'm a fan of her work. Please welcome the queen of limbo, Shamika Campbell. Welcome to the show. Hi, thank you. So, I love it. Limbo is not just a passion, it's your family business, if you will. Your mom is right here. Yes, your grandma, is. Lynette, was also a skilled limbo artist. Yeah. Yeah. Um, your family is from Trinidad, Tobago. Yes, Trinidad and Tobago. I, um, I, by the way, I'm Trinidad and Tobago mean a lot to me because it's like our number one Caribbean market. Thank you very much, yeah. everybody in Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> uh, but you, you started yes. training when you were just 14. 14 years old. What made you want to follow in the footsteps of Sherry, your mom, and your, and your grandmother? I mean, really seeing my mom perform um, has always been in inspiring to me. Right. It's like she's like my idol. So growing up, watching her perform, I used to like do the limbo contest because she, as she used to limbo. So after they did their like floor performance, they used to have like the audience members come up and, you know, and I used to participate in that. And that's when I kind of like realized my um, interest in limbo. It's got to be I, a gift too. I mean, there she is. there's your, oh, that's your mom. Look at her. <laughs> yeah, that's my but, mom. You know, I think too, because this is one of those things that means something culturally Absolutely. to the people of Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah. And when people say, well, I'm going to make a living, this is not just about being at a bar or a hotel having fun. Exactly. This is about culture. Yes. Lola well, Limbo originated in Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah. So I'm absolutely honored to like, keep this culture going and keep the culture alive, especially with it being in my family, with my grandmother limboing, my yeah. mom. It's only right that I limbo, right? Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> and really, because as I said, this, this show, people make snap judgments. They might say, oh, you can't yeah. make a living doing that. Right. And then there you are at the Cosmopolitan Hotel, yes. hanging out with Usher, yeah. and at <laughs> Usher's party, impressing him with you. Right, right. 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 Yes. There, there's God. Usher. Yes. I'm even surprised at where, you know, I was able to take. What do you have you in know, your hand? Limbo. I have drinks. Oh. I had his shots, his birthday shots. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Yes. I mean, their Usher is melting hearts everywhere, and you uh, get to be. The, oh, my yes. God. <laughs> Thank you so much. That was surreal. In 2010, you broke the Guinness World Records for the lowest limbo ever at 8.5 inches. Yes. In I actually set the record. You set the record. Yes. Oh, you set the record. Yes. So, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. Just for fun. So, so, so the physicality of yes. this, though, this requires you to literally hold your breath. Yes. You are contorting your body. Yes. This also, this is a... This is physical, so it comes Very. with tension on your body. This is not easy on your body. It's not yeah. as if she just walks out on stage. You have to stretch. Yes. You have to warm your body up yeah. in this very rigorous way. Yes, and as I get older, <laughs> <laughs> let's just say it's not getting any easier. Yeah. Like, the hips are getting a bit tighter. The knees are getting a bit weaker. <laughs> so, like, it's, it's so much more, like, before, like, after training for like maybe like five, six years, yeah. I was like, you know, I'll go in the airport and I'll just limbo in and I'll just, like the preparation as I got older definitely takes a lot more. It's a lot longer. Wow. Um, I have to be a lot more safe because the injury risk is a lot higher. Wow. Um, and then I was doing 10 shows a week in Las Vegas. Right. It was so much on my body, but it, it's something that 
kind of like surprised. I surprised myself mm. because I'm like, you can do 10 shows? Wait. Oh my God. Do you know how many times I've needed you when a store is almost closed? <laughs> oh my God. That Wait. came in handy. That came you in know, handy. I promise you this. The next time I am late and the store is closed, I'm like, no, you don't. Shemika. I'm about to call Shamika right now. <laughs> Where's my girl? Well, I think it is to your point. A lot of people look at it and they see you do it so effortlessly. They yes. judge it as being easy. It yes. is not easy. It's not easy. And coming up, Shamika is showing, they say us in this group. They're not going to show us. She's going to show us <laughs> by doing it in an exclusive performance you don't want to miss. We'll be right back. Yeah. With the queen of limbo, Shamika Campbell, the three-time Guinness World Record holder, has an exclusive performance for the Tamlin fam with her mom, Sherry, as her assistant. Take it away. 